Hello everyone, welcome to a special video today. This video is a milestone for my channel. It is the 100th subscriber special, so that's really cool. I'll be going over some Beatles related news and I'll be showing a couple records later on in the ch in the in the video. But uh first I'd like to thank you to all the su su subscribers I currently have. And all the people that comment and like the video and watch the video, I really appreciate it. Um, when I first started this channel, I have uh, i didn't really know where it would uh, take off and go to, so having a 100 subscribers is pretty cool. Um, the reason why, or one of the reasons why I started a YouTube channel is because I've been watching other vinyl community uh, record channels on YouTube for about 6 or 7 years now, and I always thought it would be a be kind of fun to make my own channel some uh, some day, so I finally did. It's been a little over a year now, but uh, it's pretty cool to reach 100 subscribers. So thank you very much. And then I'm gonna go over some Beatles related news here. We're gonna start off with the George Harrison "All Things Must Pass" 50th anniversary re-release reissue. Um, I'm gonna get. I pre-ordered. The uh, limited edition Spider Vinyl, um, All Things Must Pass uh, reissue. Um, I thought it was a cool little variant, kind of unique, and I'll still get all the, the new remixes of the songs. And then for the outtakes, something I'm going to wait and just get like the three CD uh, box set on release date. Um, the Uber box set and the Super Deluxe, Super Deluxe box sets are pretty cool but uh, they're also pretty pricey <laughs> as you know but um I'll probably just save up my money for the let it be and Beatles related type items still still holding off on solo stuff on getting kind of the higher and pricey ones so um still kind of focus on Beatles right now and specifically just the group but um speaking of let it be and the get back film that kind of goes along in the next Beatles news is that the um, the new Get Back film is not going to be in theaters anymore. It's going to be on Disney Plus at, towards the end of November, which is kind of unfortunate. I was I was kind of looking forward to, to go into movie theaters and watch it on the big screen with uh, friends and family. Um, usually uh, movie theaters have some promotional posters and they can It'll be kind of a cool experience, I think, to um, see it on the big screen. But the good thing is we'll get six hours instead of probably two, two and a half maybe in the movie theaters. So that's pretty cool. But um, I was also kind of thinking that there's Record Store Day Black Friday. And it's going to be real close to the, the TV series premiere. So maybe they could um, do a special release um, alongside the Get Back film, and then have some cool Record Store Day release. I think that would be a really good idea. But um, that's about all the Beatles news I could really think of. And then for this 100th subscriber special, I thought it would be really cool to show what my 100th record uh, categorized and organized in my record collection would be. So the 100th record in my collection is The Beatles' Help. This is a UK first pressing on the black and yellow Parlophone label from 1965. There's the back. And I'll show you a close up of the record label. There we go. The uh, first pressing is indicated by the, uh, the font type, has the serifs on it. So very cool. I only need one more UK first pressing to kind of complete the whole UK first pressing series. I'd need a, uh, a rubber sole first pressing and then I'll have all the UK albums from the 60s and 1970. Um, so now that's my, for, as a little bonus, that was my 100th LP, and I'm going to show you my 100th 
45 if just to get some more kind of time on this kind of shortish video but it happened to be a pretty rare picture sleeve happened to be the Beatles can't buy me love with you can't do that and I bought this in a record uh, record show in Austin Texas which is a pretty big record show that happens every year so I got that a couple years ago as kind of I was a kind of a graduation kind of saving money that kind of thing and I saw it for sale I thought it was a reasonable price and so I picked it up and it looks real to me I, I, I bought from a reputable, reputable seller so I was pretty happy with that purchase so if any of you watching want to comment your hundredth record in your collection it doesn't have to be Beatles um, just however you organize it start from one countdown to a hundred and see what record it is and if you have any uh, special connections to it or reasons why you have it in your collection it would be kind of fun to know if you want to make your own video about it that would be also kind of cool but um, that kind of wraps up the uh, 100 subscriber special so thank you again uh, for all your subscribes and comments and uh, thanks for watching